Welcome back to the Civic Sci TV News Show. I'm your host, Jake Krause, bringing you the latest in the world of civic science. This week, we have some exciting new research and informative webinars, including how to fund science outreach. So be sure to stick around until the very end. A new study found that when researchers joined in the fun of community dancing, it helped to improve engagement with science in underserved communities. A research team in Leicester teamed up with dance schools in lower income neighborhoods with large Asian populations to engage those groups more in science. They exercised through dance, followed by discussions on local health research projects. Participants formed new friendships, including with the researchers who joined in on the community dance sessions, building trust with scientists. Dance helped break down barriers and made the health scientists more approachable. The researchers then gathered feedback, which supported the idea that community projects can strengthen access to health science, especially when they are safe, accessible, relevant, and engaging. How can we improve science communication during crises? What has the COVID-19 pandemic taught us about sharing scientific information? And how can clear science communication help people make better decisions? While the Coalesce Project for Science Communication in the EU explored these questions, among others, on open science and science communication with top experts at the ESOF 2024 conference in Katowice, Poland. Their answers are helping build the new European Competence Center for Science Communication. Check out the full list of videos at the link in the description below. Turn scientific complexity into captivating narratives with a webinar from Adsteam. Dr. Yu, former NPR writer and founder of Brain Republic, will present the techniques necessary to make complex science resonate with diverse audiences. The webinar will take place on August 24th at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so be sure to register at the link in the description below. Having trouble getting your science outreach funded? The Science and Communication Outreach Committee of the American Society for Biochemistry and Molecular Biology hosts a monthly meeting on finding the funds for science outreach and public engagement projects, such as through their own grant program. The Civic Side TV Network's founder, Fanuel Mulindi, will serve as a speaker on the next panel on finding the funds for civic science as part of the next meeting on August 28th from 2 to 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you so much for watching this week's Civic Science News Roundup. Subscribe to the channel to stay up to date on the latest news and opportunities in civic science. I'm looking forward to seeing you next time.